Hello, I'm Pete Welch, Chairman of the Board of the Naples Children Education Foundation. Founders of the Naples Winter Wine Festival, for the past 20 years, your generosity has a tremendous impact on the lives of the underserved children in Collier County. Since its inception, the festival has raised over $212 million during our live auctions. The funds raised have gone directly to provide the services and resources to more than 275,000 children in the categories of child advocacy, early learning, medical health, and out-of-school time in addition to our multi-year collaboration strategic initiatives. Through your generosity, We've been given the privilege to invest into the organizations that continue to provide much needed programs that serve at risk and underprivileged children in our community. We wish we could be with all of you to help raise those critically important funds. As we begin the virtual auction, we urge you to remember that the events of this year have had a devastating effect on those children and their families. The communities we serve have been hit hard by the COVID-19 pandemic, and the need is greater than ever. Although we have fewer auction lots this year, our hope is to raise the greatest amount of life-saving aid for our most vulnerable children. We encourage you to bid high and to bid off. And remember, it's all for the kids. For the past 20 years, on one of the very last weekends in January, we all gather together for three days of the very best in wine and food, resulting in year-round impact for kids in need. The weekend culminates with a live auction under a tent at the Ritz-Carlton Golf Course in Naples, with the very best wine lots and travel experiences auctioned off anywhere in the world. Last year's celebration was incredible. Your generosity and tradition of irrational giving helped to raise a record $20 million for the underprivileged and at-risk children of Collier County. This year, COVID-19 may have kept us from gathering in person, but not from coming together to continue the tradition of making a huge difference in the lives of children. The need this year is clearly bigger than ever for the more than 40 nonprofit organizations that the Naples Children and Education Foundation supports, providing critical services to children in Collier County. So tonight, we thank you for participating in our first ever virtual auction and encourage you to bid high and bid often. By doing so, you'll make a lasting and immediate impact in the lives of so many children and their families here in Collier County. Now let's get this party started. We could not host a virtual auction without our talented auctioneers. Recognized as one of the UK's leading charity auctioneers and returning to Naples for his 20th year, the very charming Humphrey Butler. We're also proud to welcome back for her ninth year, one of Christie's most accomplished auctioneers and author of The Most Powerful Woman in the Room is You. Lydia Finette. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? The auction is about to begin. And now, welcome to the 2021 Naples Winter Wine Festival. Our journey begins at NWWF's virtual vineyard. Good evening, festival lovers, and greetings not from Port Royal, not from Old Naples, but from Camberwell, South East London, which makes South Detroit look like Old Collier Golf Club, let me tell you. But we're here, 3,500 miles away, and pleased to see you all, ladies and gentlemen, and enthusing you to do some serious, irrational giving tonight with eight lots in front of us. And we are going to kick off in the hope that you will raise your Sotheby's International Realty Paddles. We're going to kick off with lot one on the back of nearly $100,000 worth of donations already given to us following the broadcast tonight on Wink TV. 
and lot one is our usual starter, given by our noble trustees, the names of Bolzer and Bailey and Dixon and Dickinson and Hallberg and Hills and Hussey, Kane and Masterson and Medford, McNulty, Rooney, Swanson and Scott, they're all there. Well done, all of you. And they have produced a serious COVID killer of a lot with some of the finest wines available to you, ladies and gentlemen. You've got Tuscans and Cardinali and Chardonnays and Cheval Blanc and Grand La Rose and Haute Briand and Lafitte. Lafon Rocher, Pichon Longueville, Antinori, Drouin, Mondavi, Schrader, and the great rock and roll stars of Napa Valley, Gargiudo and Silver Oak. They're all there, ladies and gentlemen, and they are out there and waiting for you. All these in magnum or super magnum formats, and start me if you would. Start me here for what I would loosely describe as a shitload of wine for 20,000 bucks, ladies and gentlemen. 20,000 has start me. Off we go. I got 20,000 Bob Height. Thank you very much indeed. I've got 30,000 Bill Benyon at, at Bainan. I'm so sorry. At 30,000. At $30,000 at Paddle 8416. 30,000 is the call. At 30. At 30,000. At $30,000, you can drown in this stuff, ladies and gentlemen. Paul Hills at $40,000. Good evening, Paul. Kathleen Kapnick, fifty grand. Excellent stuff. At $50,000. The battle number, $47,33. At $50,000 now. $60,000. Joseph, Bob Clifford. Bob Clifford at $70,000. Robert Height back at $80,000. At $80,000, our initial bidder at $80,000 now. $80,000 buys all this wine at $80,000. At $80,000, do we see any more than that? What about those big legal dollars, Bob. Are you in there again? Joseph Sander, 90,000. 100 thousand dollars now paddle 2773 at 100,000 bucks this is excellent stuff ladies and gentlemen you're getting the virtual idea at 100,000 dollars at 100 now then do i smell another 10,000 dollars in there at 100,000 dollars are we sure about this think lafitte ladies and gentlemen think cheval blanc 110,000 christine williams paddle 0199 at 110 now 110,000 dollars at 110, John, you're back at 120. Paddle 2773 at 120,000. 120 now. 120,000 dollars. There's more juice in here, ladies and gentlemen. I feed it in my bones all the way from SE5 at 120,000 dollars. Are we letting it go? Have we come to a standstill? At 120, are we going to leave it there, ladies and gentlemen, at $120,000? No, we're not. 130, 6610. Well done, Joseph. At $130,000. 130 is the call now. 130. Against you, John, at 130,000. Do you want another go? Christine? Bob Height? Bob Clifford? You're all out now. 130,000 is the call. All right, Mr. Sander, 130,000 coming your way at this stage. Paddle 6610. Is that it? At $130,000. Hammers up. Are we sure about this? No tears then. No regrets. At $130,000. All out. 130. Sold. Paddle 6610. Well done. <laughs> hooray. Hooray. Excellent stuff. All right, moving on to lot number two, ladies and gentlemen. A Californian coastal adventure put together for you by Rick and Libby Germain, who would be more than generous here. And it involves high-end hospitality. It involves high-end motor cars. It involves Pebble Beach, for goodness sake. And Northern Jet Management are taking you all the way to Pebble Beach themselves. I say you've got private airfare for two of you. It's a seven-day adventure. And thrown into the mix is the new Lexus LC convertible, five litres V8 engine of pure power. A car that has been described by Top Gear here as a machine to be lusted after and worshipped, much like I do my co-auctioneer. All right, then. You've got five litres of the V8 engine of Lexus, and you've got four nights at the Pebble Beach Resort where you've got... 17 mile drive, you've got six beaches, you've got the Spanish Bay, sunsets, it's all there for you. Then you've got a bit of, bit of performance car training with the great Scott Pruitt. Scott Pruitt is a man sort of crossed between Tom Cruise and John Wayne and he's got winner and champion engraved on his heart and he'll teach you how to whip your Lexus around the track the speed of God knows what. 
And on top of that, you've got golf lessons at Pebble Beach and you have got spa treatments and you've got dinner at the Post Ranch in Sierra Mar. You then move on for two nights at the Belmont El Encanto in Santa Barbara where you've got an aerial tour, you've got a private tour of the Bien Nacido Vineyards with wine tasting and lunch and you've got a private dinner with winemaker Greg Brewer of Brewer Clifton. And if you find our very own Prince Harry out there, please send him back home because we miss him, ladies and gentlemen. All right, start me here. All the way to the west coast of California. Start me at $20,000 again at $20,000 to start me with Lexus and, and Scott Pruitt and, and plenty of his wine. And by the way, you're going home with two magnums of sine qua known, for God's sake. Their estate Syrah and their estate Grenache. So $20,000 to start me at 20. Who, who's going to kick this off, ladies and gentlemen? I want to see you there. Are we already at, my God, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110,000 dollars, ladies and gentlemen. Melissa Gardner, panel number 9392. At this stage, you want to start panicking, Melissa, because it's coming your way. At 100 and then 120 now. Kathleen Katnick at 120,000 dollars. At 120,000, but let's be fair, ladies and gentlemen, this is still given away. At 120,000 dollars. Think of that Pebble Beach. Think of that, that big sir, think of the 17 mile drive. It's all there for you, those sunsets. $120,000. It's panel 4733, ladies and gentlemen. 130,000 now. Christine Williams is in next. Well done, Christine. $130,000. You're going to look sexy as hell behind the wheel of that car at 130. And it's not just for the week, ladies and gentlemen. You've got a two year free lease on it thereafter. You're going to be zapping around town looking like Bugs Bunny. It's going to be absolutely magnificent. All right, $130,000. That's the winning bit of this stage, ladies and gentlemen. Panel 0199. There's got to be a bit more juice in here. For goodness sake, it costs that to fuel the Northern Jet Management's jet to get you out there. At 130, 140 will be next. Is there any more, ladies and gentlemen? At 130,000, 140,000, Kathleen, what a player you are. Magnificent stuff. At 140,000 now, 140, 150. Well done, Christine. Do not give up without a fight. At 150, back to paddle 0199. At 150,000, Kathleen. What do you say to that? At 150,000, you're going to say, I am not going to take it. 150,000. It's against you. You're going to lose this. You're going to lose the sunset. You're going to lose Scott Pruitt. You're going to lose, oh my God, what else are you going to lose? You're going to lose your performance car driving at $150,000. Are you done? Are you all out? No, you're not, Kathleen. Well done. 160 now. $160,000. dollars one sixty. Now, the call's out there at 160. It's 170 next. Do you want it? 170, Christine. I'm loving this. At $170,000. 170. I can almost smell that engine from here. At $170,000. It's with you, Christine. It is against you, Kathleen. And think, there's the golf lessons as well. On that finest, at that iconic course, you'll probably meet Tiger Woods. You'll probably have lunch with Tiger Woods. That's about as far as you go. Just have lunch with Tiger Woods, I would. If he invites you for a cup of tea afterwards, I'd say no. At 170, because you never know, quite know how far it's going to go. Uh, that's what they said in Vanity Fair. Anyway, $170,000. It's with you, Christine Williams. It's against you, Kathleen Kapnick. Are we sure about this? All right. Yeah. We're going to pack up now. We're going to call it quits. You're all out. The V8 engine is coming your way, Christine, at $170,000. Are we done? One last time. Paddle number 0199, $170,000 sold to you, Christine Williams. Great stuff. Now, regrettably, it is my moment to hand over to my co-auctioneer, Lydia Fanette. She's won New York's Miss Lovely Legs competition for the last decade. She is a, an award-winning author. She's a super mum. She's a trapeze artist, for God's sake, ladies and gentlemen. And she's soon to be the second Mrs. Humphrey Butler, but she doesn't yet know that. So, ladies and gentlemen, I give you Lydia Fanette.
Tell me when. Can I go? Good evening, everyone, and welcome to the second part of the auction. We have four in all. Humphrey will be back, and apparently I'm marrying him at the end of this show, so there's a lot to look forward to. My name is Lydia Finette. As you know, I am so delighted to be back here again this year. I am lucky enough to be in Naples, whereas Humphrey is in cold London, so I'm enjoying the same weather that you are, and I am thrilled to introduce lot number three. Ladies and gentlemen, if ever there was a year for champagne, it will be this year, and I am very concerned that the entire country is going to run out of it by the end of 2021. So I'm going to let Olivier Krug, with his French accent, do a much better of describing this lot than I can. And we'll roll to video, and then I'll be right back. So get your paddles ready. My dear friends, I am a bit sad to miss you, but I'm so happy to know that this auction has been made possible this year, because we need to be generous for the kids. So I wish that you all bid high, bid a lot, because it's all for the kids. What the House of Crew brought to you this year is a very, very unique and spectacular lot. This is a lot to enjoy, a lot to test, but this is also a lot that you can put aside in your cellar as the beginning of a legacy for the next generations. Indeed, like most of the great wines you are enjoying today, Krug has an almost endless aging potential. I have chosen for you some big bottles. I know you love these big bottles that we call Jeroboam, but I have also chosen for you four lots that we call from the soloist to the orchestra. Why that? Because they all include Krug soloist which, as you know well, is a very rare Krug Clodumenin. They include the Krug that plays the music of the year, the band, in a way, which is the vintage. And of course, they include the orchestra, the dream of the founder, the man in my back, my great, great, great grandfather, Joseph Krug, who wanted to offer you every year the most generous expression of champagne. So talking about generosity, be generous, Bid very high and see you next year, I promise. Cheers. Thank you so much, Olivier, and we all look forward to seeing you next year as well. So, as Olivier said, this is an incredible lot. You will have 12 Jeroboams, four each, of Krug Grand Cruvet, Krug Rosé, and Krug 2000, ladies and gentlemen. And then in addition to that, you will have 12 bottles each of the most fabulous of each year, 2002, 2003, 2004, and 2006. And on top of all of this, a private virtual tasting with Olivier. So if you have any questions about the champagne, all you need to do is let Olivier know and he will jump on and uncork the bottles with you. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm ready to see my friends on this board. Let's see those paddles go up. Thank you, Kathleen, for jumping in and starting us off. Melissa is in, John is in as well. Thank you so much. Some of these are friends, some of these are first timers. I've never met you before. Chris Klein in at 50,000. We have Kathleen back at 60, Marlissa at $70,000. There will be parties everywhere and they will be hosted by people like Max. Hello, Donna and David at $100,000. Max is back in at $110,000, ladies and gentlemen. Robert Scott, Bob Scott is in at $120,000, ladies and gentlemen. This is already shaping up to be quite an auction, but as we know, there is nothing quite like Krug. So I'm expecting you to dig deep because also remember, and this is my favorite point of this auction, you are spending all of this dollar, all of this money for champagne, but at the end of the day, this is for the kids. And John knows that, and he's at 130,000. And Kathleen Kapnick, $140,000. Now we're talking, Naples, here we go. $140,000. Anytime you need it, Olivier Krug is there to guide you through these incredible bottles. John is back at 150,000, I believe a new festival attendee. Welcome to Naples, John, at 150,000. Come on, Kathleen, what's say 160? We have so many bidders jumping in. We are still at $150,000. Again, you're gonna need to think about the parties that are gonna be taking place at the end of the year. You're gonna need to be well stocked, and Kathleen will be at $160,000. What do you say, John? 170? We're at 160,000. 
on the board right now, John is in at $170,000. The bidding is fierce. If we were under the tent right now, the noise would be deafening. There would be people jumping up and down. The video would be screened on you. All you have to do tonight is hit the button. My hope is that you've all been at home drinking as long as we have been, usually by the end of the festival at this point, which would give us a nine-hour head start at this point. So we are right now at $170,000 with John. Is there any advance from my virtual room, and by that I mean your living room. We are at 170,000, John, a fantastic bidder jumping in to help us get to our goal at $170,000. Kathleen, I will pause for one more second before I hammer this down. John, thank you so much. 170,000 is bid for you, sir. Thank you very much. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I can't even believe that I'm saying this as our children applaud behind me.